Level 7. The Darkness. Level Classification. Difficulty 4 out of 5, Zero Light, Bottomless, Dangerous Entities, Unstable in General. Entity Count 4 out of 5, Large Amounts of Aggressive Entities. Chaos Gradient 3 out of 5, Zero Natural Photons. Bassett Fraser Index 5 out of 5, This level is extremely dangerous and will lead to your death if stayed in for a prolonged amount of time. Description. Level 7 is an infinite space in complete darkness, filled with a layered maze of railings, catwalks, pipes, and infinitely tall cooling towers. The temperature hovers around 20 degrees Fahrenheit, 7 degrees Celsius, so warm clothing is advised. Level 7 does not merely lack light, there is no such thing as light in level 7, any light source taken into level 7 will cease to emit light upon entering. The main dangers in level 7 are of walking off the edge of a railing's catwalk in the darkness and falling to your death, freezing from the cold, being accosted by bandits, or getting attacked by entities. The level is inhabited by groups of bandits that climb along the pipes in the darkness, having memorized their layout. Some bandits are believed to even make use of human echolocation to navigate in the absence of light. The level is also inhabited by long-limbed humanoid entities known as pipe dwellers, which are attracted to sound. These entities should be avoided as they're carnivorous and, while they lack strength individually, they will easily overpower wanderers, as they hunt in packs. It is believed that the energy that would have become real photons in level 7 is instead emitted as neutrinos. The pipes in level 7 receive waste heat from levels all across the back rooms, which they run through cooling towers. Rather than emitting thermal radiation in the form of infrared light, the towers emit neutrinos instead. Together with level 3, level 7 completes the backroom's energy cycle, serving as the heat sink. Neutrinos seem to behave mostly as they do in our universe, passing harmlessly through most matter as if it did not even exist. This allows level 7 to absorb enormous amounts of waste heat without overheating itself. Very rarely, neutrinos can impact normal matter, energizing it as if struck by a photon. The high concentration of neutrinos in level 7 makes this relatively common, causing occasional flashes in the eyes when enough neutrinos strike the retina to overcome the minimum detection threshold. Level 7 is not a safe environment in any way, and the end does not recommend spending extended periods of time on it, and if possible it is recommended to avoid it entirely. Pipe Dwellers Level 7 has another anomalous property to it, a transformative property. Spending an extended period of time in the level will cause massive physiological changes, such as loss of pigmentation from the skin, sharpened teeth, extended and loosened limbs, and loss of eyes, due to a lack of purpose, paralleling many of the adaptations seen in cave animals. These entities also regain hunger and will start to death without proper sustenance. The physiological changes are accompanied by measurably more drastic psychological changes, which begin before the physical changes even set in. They begin with an introduction of a more primal mindset, then as time passes, speech ability is lessened and then removed, instincts are heightened, and eventually, all logic ceases to exist. Pipe dwellers are to be avoided at all costs. As they have regained their sense of hunger, they have come to rely on human corpses for sustenance, though if there are no humans for an extended period of time, they will resort to cannibalism. They hunt in packs generally, using overwhelming numbers and sharpened teeth to tear flesh directly from the body, not giving regard to killing. Pipe dwellers can be killed in manners similar to humans, but they rarely ever travel alone and if you kill one, more will likely follow. Communities. Due to the difficulty and nature of this level, permanent civilizations are unfeasible and impossible to sustain for lengthy periods of time. Entrances and Exits. Entrances. Level 7 can be entered by going through shadows in the boiler room of level 6. Any of this level's sub-levels are also entrances. Exits. The only exits from level 7 are pipes and cooling towers. By going walking through the center of a cooling tower, you will end up underwater in level 8. By going through an open pipe, you will end up inside one of the buildings in level 8. Other exits include level 7's sub-levels, 